Uh, yo. So that was good, y'all, man. Let's get back to the game. This time I got Omori. I can't remember what episode this is. Episode 5, episode 6. I'm not even gonna lie. I literally have no idea what episode this is. Uh, I'm fucking it all up. My intro, I'm stuttering. Anyway, uh, I don't got nothing else to say. Somebody busting down my damn door. I ain't finna wait somebody else. Time we just gonna hop into it, bro. Who is it? Probably Kill again. That's the only nigga that don't got manners. You feel me? Yeah, Kill, Kill, yeah. Hello? Hello? Sunny? Are you there? That bitch ain't going outside? Oh, open the door. They changed my angle and shit. I'm like, he ain't going. <laughs> I'm on voice crack like that again. Yeah, hi, Sonny. Top of the morning to you. <laughs> well, more like noon, actually. Turns out Hero's not coming back until around dinner today. So I thought I'd drop by a little later. Mom is having me buy some stuff at Farway Plaza before he comes back and... I thought it might be funner if we went together. Did you want to come along, Sonny? Of course you do. Come on. Let's go! Hey. Nyah! The orange cat looks hungry. Feed us some fish? I don't get no fucking fish, gang. I don't get no fish. Kale smells? What the heck? What happened here? Dang it. Must have been Aubrey and that scooter, gang. Yeah. Sonny, be honest. Do I smell... Don't erase it if it's true, funk ass nigga. <laughs> Alright, bro, my bad. So I do remember, I don't know if he go tell me that I can't go down there, but I do remember one of y'all said to go to the church because it's like a scene that I'm supposed to see or some shit like that. So I'm gonna slide over there real quick and see what's, we'll see what's to it. Like a back door scene or some shit. Oh, there go the door. Well, one of them. Okay. Well, we back here now. Who this is? Teddy bear. Okay. Flowers. Handstone. We don't know none of them. We gonna fuck around and find Mari back here, ain't it? That's why you sent me back here, ain't it? So far, puzzle pieces. Ooh, ain't that one of them dead niggas in my game? They be playing with the puzzles? Name Neb or something? My fault, who's you? Something in the air seems amiss lately. The spirits, they are howling. Sounds like they're preparing for a welcoming party. Someone close by may be joining them soon. <laughs> uh, what's with that look? You think I'm crazy or something? Don't be so quick to judge. You'd believe it too if you've seen what I've seen. I apologize, bro. One of these one of these characters I'm controlling happens to be a, a serial killer, I believe. I think one of my characters is the killer, and I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a, I'm gonna be the one sending niggas to the to the to the to the to the howling spirits. What is those bullets? Baguettes? Bread? Smells toasty. Brand new bread for sure. Oh my gosh. Brand new bread, that's that new money. Can you tell I'm new money? I don't got no money. How is new money you don't got no money? Bitch, you think you old money? You ain't shit, nigga. You ain't nothing but, but old quarters with, with, with tarnish on them. What? That's what you get for talking shit, though. Because I don't even know what that means. Okay, obviously, okay. That one's glowing, obviously. I have to go talk to that one, but okay, let's see. My dearest Miri Mari, the sun shined brighter when she was here. Miri. It feels so long ago already. I was still think about her all the time i'm sure you do too you know when miramari passed away he wrote he really stopped caring about everything he didn't want to get out of bed for school or even eat he stopped taking care of himself stopped baking and cooking it was like that for almost a year mom and dad didn't know what to do either we all tried to help him be supportive but Nothing was really working. One night, I went over to him while he was all huddled up in his blankets and started saying stuff. Stuff like how we all miss him and how we wanted him to make it better. Everyone is really worried. How Mary wouldn't want to see him like this. I thought I was helping him, but... But Hero... <laughs> Hero got angry. He suddenly got up and started screaming and yelling at me about a bunch of stuff. Some of it was pretty hurtful, too, but I think I blocked out a lot of it. His eyes were already super red, but the more he yelled, the harder he cried. I tried my best to calm him down, but whatever I said just made him worse. I'd never seen Hero do anything close to that before. It really took me by surprise. I was so scared that, well, I started crying, too. Eventually, Mom and Dad ran our room and rushed over to hug him and calm him down. But they completely ignored me. 
I think that's where Hero got his senses back because he ran to me and hugged me right away. Just kept apologizing over and over. But at least Hero got better. Uh, he got a lot better after that. He started taking care of himself again and focused on school a lot more. And joining a bunch of extracurricular stuff. He's not actually good at everything, but he still works really hard, so I'm proud of him. Guess he's a little more closed off now than he used to be, but I'm really just glad to have my brother back. Anyway, sorry for the long story. I don't think I've ever told anyone that before. It's not his fault, but I still think Hero blames himself for Miyamura's death. Hero's never visited here. Not even once. I know it really hurts, but maybe it might be good, it might be good for him. I don't know. Mm, my Igor Orchid. In the language of flowers, it symbolizes the phrase, my thoughts will follow you into your dream. Similar faraway town. It's supposed to represent a gateway to a better life. You remember learning about this in class with your elementary school, but you can't remember all the details. Damn. Alright, that was that. R.P. Mary Mari, man. I don't talk to no fucking pastor. That nigga doing worse than me. You hear me? <laughs> oh my god. Y'all don't know nothing about no Fredo Bang. I ain't trying to talk to no fucking pastor. That nigga doing worse than me. You hear me? Can't talk to that window. Knock, knock. There's no response. Going through her back door. Don't do that. That's trifling. All right, well, I guess we're going to Faraway Plaza now. Yup, yup. I don't see no more wormholes. What do we have here? It's been kind of stressful lately. But people watching our house put things into perspective. Uh, maybe we can have it to come to the party more often. I guess I'm going to shut up, bitch. I remember you. Do I care about any of these niggas? I don't think I do. I'm going to just go to the motherfucking plaza. I don't know why I'm stopping right here. Fuck y'all. Maybe there's something interesting, though. Ain't that Basil? Hey, Kel. Hey, Sonny. What's up, Basil? Nice to see you out and about. You feeling better after yesterday? Huh? Oh, yesterday? What do you mean? You had a big stomach ache, didn't you? That's why you had to go to the bathroom. Uh, uh, oh, right. Yeah, I, I feel much better now. Did you want to hang out with us today? Sunny's not going to be around for much longer, you know. I don't know. Maybe tomorrow. Sorry. Ah, don't worry. You don't have to force yourself. We can always catch up later. Yeah, you're. You're right. Uh, okay then. See. See you later, I guess. All right. Why are you standing in the corner? Why is guy all on my screen? What's up with you, gang? All American guy. <laughs> Making patties is hard work. Well, once I seek my meat, the Nintendo juice, it's all gonna be worth it. Mmm. Can almost taste it now. Dear, pay attention. The patties are burning. Oh shit! Thanks, son. That was close. Fuck. Shit, fuck. Let me get these little trashes so I can make me some money, on. Let me get these little trashies so I can make me some money, on. She ain't gonna pay me too much, but it's a little song. Play with me, I got gun. Play with me, I got hung. I got huh, you gon' huh when I talk my words cause you don't understand cause you dumb. Uh. Uh, but I ain't gon' call you no bum because that's derogatory. Just cause you don't got no job don't mean you uh 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 worthless. Just because you don't got no job don't mean you ain't got shit to to worry for. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Alright, I'm done. I don't know what type of freestyle that was. Hello, youngins. See you have some trash with you. Thanks. I'll be sure to dispose of this properly. It's ten dollars for your help. <laughs> well, she gave me more she gave me more money that time, so. I, ain't got, I don't got nothing to say to the hag. Thank you. Nothing except thank you. She talking about some what can I say except... You, all right, all right, all right, lady. Let's see. I'm pretty sure we got to stop at Gino's Pizza and the bakery at the other mart. Lead the way, sonny. Uh, nigga. As I was saying, can you believe in her? But then... Mm-hmm. They talking shit about Aubrey. They talking shit about Aubrey. Oh, my gosh. Hey, sonny, I remember something. Do you remember when we were kids? Me and you used to sneak out of the house to go to Avi's in the middle of the night. I could never get up for school on time the next morning. And here me and Martin would always ask why we look so tired. Yeah, I'm sure they suspected something. But I'm glad they never told our moms. We were pretty adventurous back then, huh? <laughs> you fucked up my freestyle, so now I gotta re-enter that room. Uh, Omori ain't kale today I don't wanna play because I got go to hell today I ain't going to hell today I might send you for me Send a message to the devil Say I'm horny Whoa, pause Not for him, not for nothing down there Unless it's that demon from Slater Princess You know that I'd do something to her 
As long as she consent first I ain't trying to do something against the will Cause that will hurt all right, you know what? I'm getting out. I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. That freestyle, I lost it. I lost it. I never even had it, and I lost it somehow. I might ban myself from even speaking again after that one. I'm not even gonna let y'all hear what I said. Gino's pizza is the bomb. This one disgusting, dirty, greasy-looking cheese pizza, just the way I like it. Let's dig in. So, we're still on to go to our secret hangout spot today, right? Gonna bring my fishing pole. <laughs> Made it myself. Out <laughs> of a cool stick and a jump rope yesterday. You think it'll work, Charlie? <laughs> so we're going to the awesome hotel. <laughs> That's a perfect date spot. Yeah, I'll be sure to bring one of my special ladies. Swimming sounds pretty fun. Well, while you're fooling around being babies, I'm going to be busy skipping rocks. I've been looking for the perfect rocks all week. <laughs> you can try all you want, Kim, but you'll never beat Aubrey's record. Shut up, Michael. Like any girls would actually want to go to the lake with you without paying them. I told you to call me the Maverick. <laughs> Ah! I bit my tongue. <laughs> Dumb ass nigga. Ah, master, are you hurt? You pulled the fight, man. What? <laughs> Alright, bro. What do we have for? Hello, and welcome to Geno's Pizza. What can I get for you? Yeah, I'm here to pick out a new order. I see. What would you like? Oh, I know. Would you like pizza? No, no, no. I think my mom phoned in an order from for a hero sandwich this morning. Yeah, I'm just here to pick it up. Oh, I see. Your family keeps ordering sandwiches instead of pizza. But it's on the menu, isn't it? Hmm. Yeah, you're right. I guess so. Okay, I'll go get it. Yeah, do your fucking job and stop. All right, you know what? You know, that guy was a real dick. I don't know if I ever told you this, but that's what my brother's Nick's name is, Hero. You'd think it'd be because, uh... Some really cool reason, like he saved the puppet when he was a kid or something. But no, he just really likes sandwiches. Wow. Okay, here's your hero sandwich. Please enjoy. I would have never knew that. You got Kale's pizza order. I, for, honestly, I thought the opposite. I thought, I thought they named that sandwich at the hero because he did something raw. All right, we're good to go now, Sonny. I'm ready when you are. Now we just need to get the cookies from the. Let me talk to Aubrey. She ignored me. Ah! Sonny and Kel, what are you doing here? Don't you know it's rude to bother people when they're eating? Ew, it's a nerd. You listen long. We ain't no business with you today. Pizza. I knew he was going to say that. That's so funny to me. All right, bro. No! I hate when I get locked in dialogue, bro. All right, see, that's why I don't talk to niggas now. Who is this? Why is you walking around all shysty? Yesterday, while I was eating a banana, I found a cool overgrown lake area just behind the park. But soon after, a bunch of hooligans on scooters rolled in and kicked me out. And to make matters worse, they even threw away my banana. Uh, I, I can't let a bunch of kids boss me around. I'm an adult now. A, a young lady, at least. What? What? It said messy hair men. Young lady? <laughs> Steal a banana and give it to him. Bananas, just a bit underripe. Okay. Let's go to the bakery. I want to place an order there. Yeah, no shit. That's, that's where I was going, I believe. Y'all told me to heal myself, which... Okay, I'm healed now. Y'all told me to heal myself. I got to go to the motherfucker. What you call the medicine? Ain't this the bakery right here? Y'all. A money machine. Oh, <laughs> why they got me in the game? All right. Bad joke. Bad joke. Good joke. For sure. Snap to it. I guess a poem, yeah. Welcome to our family bakery. What would you like? All right, I'm gonna pick up water. Hmm. Ah, yes. Your mother said you'd be coming. Though, I expect you to be here a bit earlier. I'll go grab your order, though. Why is you worried about my... All right, folks. Did you know? This bakery belongs to Michael's family. I guess you can't really tell because he wears that horrible yellow wig all the time. Seems like he's making a pretty big effort to stand out and be different. Here's your order, sir. We hope to see you soon. Please enjoy your baked goods. You got Kale's bakery order. For sure that. Cool, thanks. All right. We're good to go now, Sonny. I'm ready when you are. 
Alright, let's get the fuck up out of there. I keep forgetting I can't run inside the building, so I be pressing shift. And I'm like, why my shit not working? I guess my characters got halfway, uh, halfway manners. Fake goods. Check. Sandwiches. Check. Well, that's everything. And just in time, too. Looks like the sun is about to set. Let's go back to my house. Here should be coming anytime now. Close that back door. Can't okay, get snaked out by the homie. Before we go in, I should probably mention that my mom's gonna be a little mad about me taking so long with the groceries. I was supposed to bring everything back around noon, but I got carried away doing other stuff, and well, you know how it goes. But anyway, I thought there was a solution for this. So, I think you should walk in first. Then we should see you first to get all excited. And most importantly, she forget to yell at me. See, it's a win win for everyone. <laughs> got it. Okay, let's go. We used to really do this shit when we, when I was a kid. Hell yeah, we used to actually do that shit on bro. Mom, Sunny's here. Ooh. What took you so long, Kel? I set you off hours ago. How does it take? Oh my, is that Sunny? It must be. It's good to see you again. But dear, you look so thin. Have you been eating properly? Here's the stuff you asked for, Mom. You get a bakery order and pizza order to kill his mother. All right, son, let's go upstairs in my bedroom. Now, wait just a second, young man. Bye, Mom. See you when dinner's ready. Ugh. That bitch got up out of the, the big-ass room. Well, here it is. Make yourself at home. Look, I got a basketball hoop and a boombox. That's like I always wanted. Here, I'll play a song for you. Yeah, it's pretty sweet. You go freestyle? Mom won't let me play too loud, though, because she says it's bad for Sally. I recognize that name, but I don't know who that is. Oh, wait. You haven't met Sally yet, huh? <laughs> Guess what, Sonny? I'm a big brother now! Sally's my baby sister. My mom will probably bring her downstairs around dinner time. She's really small and really cute. <laughs> Kill! There's a girl at the door. She says she's here to see you. Why do mama sound like... Alright. Huh? I wonder who that could be. Hey. Who the fuck is that? Oh, it's Polly. Hey, Kel. I mean, what? Hey, Kel. Hey, Sonny. S sorry for intruding. Just wondering if you know where Basil is. Thought he might be with you. That bitch at the park. Basil? Hmm. We did see him at the park earlier, but that was a while ago. If you see him, can you tell him to come home, please? Really worried about him. Of course, Polly. We'll be on the lookout. Thanks. No, I can count on you guys. Uh. Hmm. Basil's missing today? I have a bad feeling about this. Especially with Aubrey and the Scooter Gang around. Maybe we should try to find him before it gets dark. Can we go look for him, Mom? Pretty please? Well, that girl did look awfully worried. <sighs> okay. Just make sure to be home by dinner. Alright, for sure. Alright, Mama Dukes. Be right back. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> All right, bro. How do you know what he said? How do you know what he said? Obviously, let's go back to the last place we saw him. And he obviously won't be here any longer. Man, where could Basil be? Man, I don't see him anywhere. So, somebody help! Sonny, did you hear that? I think that was Basil. Help me! Please! Where is his voice coming from? Hold on a second. I know this area. His voice is coming from our old hangout spot. So Aubrey did that. The entrance should still be around somewhere. Fuck! Uh. Whoa. Whoa, and it's dreary back here? It's dreary than a bitch back here. Help me! Somebody! The fuck are you yelling for, Basil? You're making a scene. This place is our secret hangout spot. You can't be here because you weren't invited. Dang it, Basil. Be quiet! Someone's gonna find this place. Yeah, and we're not trying to hurt you. We just want you to get out of here. What? How is secret and other niggas know about it? Hey, stop it! What are you doing to Basil? What the... Oh, man, it's killing Sonny again. 
How do you always show up? How did you even find this place? Come on, Aubrey. We gotta defend our turf. All right, bro. Aubrey. Ugh. Go away, Kel. You're not welcome here. This is our spot. Oh, this is your spot now? Well, this used to be our old hangout spot. Wasn't it, Aubrey? Watch it or we'll mess you up. Fine. If that's how it's gonna be, then at least stop bullying Basil. You weren't even doing anything to him. You just started screaming for no reason. Yeah, sure you weren't. Why should I believe you? I'm telling the truth. Stop being such a self-righteous prick. Come on, guys. Let's make sure this is the last time these two mess with us. That sounds good to me. Yeah, I'm right behind you, the Maverick. Let's settle this, Kel. If you and Slayer are going to pick a fight with me and my friends, you got one. Come on, gang. Let's teach them a lesson. All six of them. What? Okay. Next attack deals more damage. I don't get no heal. I don't get no toy. All right. You know what? Okay, but he can heal, though. I forgot he could do that. Focus. And yeah, Kale encourages Sunny's attack. Raises Sunny's attack. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. So... I have to pick who to hit, right? Oh, no. They're all one person. Okay, good. God damn it. 17 damage is not shit. 18 damage is not shit. Can I run? Of course not. I'm about to just get my ass whooped. As always. Yep, over with for me. Whatever, man. Let's just get this over with. <sighs> is this real life? We won, Master. We won. Saves you right, nerds. Come on, hungry. Let's go get some food. <laughs> Kel, Sunny, get the fuck out of here. There's no way I'm supposed to win that. There's no way I'm supposed to win that. Whoa, we we really did it. The evil forces have been defeated. Dang. Sorry, Sunny. I think we could take on six people at once if they are a bunch of dweebs. It's over, Kel. Leave this place. You don't belong here anymore. No, I won't. Can't just leave here knowing that this is the person you've become. I mean, who would Miri Mari think? Why do you keep bringing her up? Loki, that's my question too. I'm not gonna lie. That, that's a crazy. Kale, you, I, ain't, I ain't gonna lie. Read the room, gang. Oh no. Do I have to keep saying it? Miri Mari's already fucking dead. Can you stop with that? She wouldn't even have said that if you ain't bringing up. Kale, you. I know Kale's an idiot, but like, come on, bro. That's not how you do that. While you're at it, try the tough guy act too. I don't believe you when you say you don't care about us anymore. You have all your new friends now, but you're still hanging out at our old hangout spot. Do I really have to spell it out for you? Don't listen to him, Aubrey. He's just spouting crap like usual. All right, Aubrey? Hmm. This isn't fun anymore. I want to go home. Let's get out of here. You said it. Stop bringing up this man dead sister gang. She already told you. All right, fuck, whatever. You coming, Aubrey? She already told. This is my thing. This is the only reason I'm saying that to kill. She already told you where she stands on the Mirror Mari shit. She was hurt as fuck and she felt like everybody abandoned her when motherfuckers died. So you bringing that shit up to manipulate her is not working because she felt like you went there for her in the first fucking place. Oh, okay. Catch you later then. Oh, 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 she's red hot. Aubrey. Ugh. Why? Why do you guys keep coming back? I just want you to leave me alone. Sonny, why? Why did you show up now? I mean, because Basil was crying. <laughs> uh, we just want you to stop messing with Basil. What's your deal with him all of a sudden? We used to be friends. We all used to be. Where the fuck is Basil going? Oh, he stood up. You think I'm the bully, but you're all so messed up too. Where were you when Miramari died? Where were any of you? I mean, I mean, that's that's my blood sister, so I, you know? Eh, that's my blood sister gang, so you know. And you, 
You're the worst, Basil. How dare you still show your face to me after what you did? The fuck did he do? Aubrey, I... Get away from me! Oh, that bitch about to die. That bitch about to die. Shit. That bitch about to die. The fuck, Aubrey? What are you doing? He's taking this way too far. Wait, wait, hold on. I didn't mean to... Sonny, don't worry about Aubrey. I'll keep her busy. Go help Basil. That bitch cannot swim. You want to save Basil? I know he's not going to. Oh, he does. Good shit, good shit. I seen that little tentacle shit at the end. I was like, uh, hello? All right. Mary Mari. Hmm. Okay, she's moving with me. What is that? Damn Pokemon poop. Nope, I'm getting touched by tentacles again. Here she come. Me and Mari. Oh, she can. Okay, wow. What is that? A damn scuba diver? Who is talking to me in water? I ain't never heard H2O language before. I want these tendrils to not make contact with my body, but I know it's going to happen eventually. And I can't do anything about it. I can't do anything. Ooh, a niff. Big niff. I'm a serial killer. I get niggas out of here. I am a serial killer. I get niggas out of here. Oh, God. Is that my demon? That's the demon that tells me to sacrifice the souls for him. He said, if you bring me all of them, I'll leave you forever. You can finally have peace. See what I'm saying? Something drags you down. That's what I'm saying. That bitch trying to get me. Afraid. Sonny takes 40 damage Im just off, just immediately. Calm down. Calm down. Is that a person? Steady your heartbeat. Don't be afraid. It's not as scary as you think. Eh, it did nothing. Well, you have to keep going. Don't give up. No matter how impossible it seems. You reach out to the voice and remember how to persist. Okay. What is persist? Heart cannot reach zero for one turn. Ooh. Water pulls Sunny in different directions. Sunny takes eight damage. It did nothing. Oh my god. Well, focus, I guess. I don't I don't really know what combination of moves I'm supposed to be doing. Am I supposed to wait until it's because it's going down by eight. So maybe I'm supposed to wait until it's at eight and then... All right, I get it. This shit look like hair. I'm talking about something. That's a person right there. That's a person at the bottom of this little tendril shit. Do y'all see what I'm seeing? Look, he's cutting right at it like he's trying to cut it loose. Supposed to persist right here. I mean, that bitch healed. I didn't click heal, I don't think. Oh, it's just getting weaker every time I press persist. Okay. Wow, I did all... <laughs> I'm a fucking fool, bro. My bad, y'all. At least y'all can see that little human-shaped shit I was talking about, though, because I took so long to figure that out. That bitch just in limbo. Do you even know how to swim? That bitch jumped in the water and never knew how to swim. He better than me. What the fuck is that? An elbow? Hero! What up, gang? What the hell with you, player? Hmm. It's like Basil's breathing is steady. We need to get him somewhere warm quickly. Yeah, he's had a rough day. Let's get him home as soon as possible. Wait! Where do you think you're all going? That's enough. Don't you think you've caused enough trouble? Come on, guys. We gotta go. Hey, I might be dumb. I might be dumb. I might be dumb. I might be dumb. I just might be. But Aubrey, right now, seems like she's kind of crying for help a little bit. Kel, you're an idiot. You've been trying to emotionally bother her, which is why you keep bringing up emotionally tight topics. She's emotionally bothered. What was your goal after you got her emotionally bothered? Just to run away again? It's exactly why she feel like you abandoned her. Like Basil's breathing steady, but we should, I wanted to save at that picnic spot. That's fucked up, though. All right, whatever. Yep, I guess it's fuck Aubrey. 
That's okay then. Somebody said, bro, did you see what she did? Did you see what she did? Yeah, I saw what she did. I want to know what the fuck Basil got going on too, though. She hate that nigga for some reason. I, I really want to know. <laughs> she hate that nigga for some reason, gang. I was hoping to get some info. This motherfucker, haven't you done enough today? After you basically kicked that shit up. Somebody said, how did he kick it up? Oh yeah, his home, my fault. Somebody said, how did Kale kick that shit up? Man, I don't know, bro. I think a while ago, I would have. I just would have left Aubrey alone. I would have just left her alone, gang. I wouldn't even been bothering her no more. That girl is broken. Not that she can't be fixed, but, you know, I'm not finna keep antagonizing this girl when she obviously is emotionally unstable. That's why I feel like he keep kicking that shit up. But anyway, Basil, what happened? Is he okay? His breathing's stable. Just needs to change her clothes and warm bed. Okay, I can do that. Quick, come inside. I forget folks was a doctor. Boy, man school, something like that. You can bring him to his room. Sure thing. That was intense. And I hope Basil wakes up soon. That bitch will be alright. Hero! Hey, Kill. What up, Sonny? It's like Basil's gonna be just fine, man. Y'all don't gotta worry about it. I heard from Mom that Basil was missing and you two went looking for him. When I was running around the park, I heard some commotion coming from around the hangout spot. Guess I got there right in the nick of time. So, what was happening back there? Aubrey, she pushed Basil into the lake. <laughs> what? That was Aubrey back there? No way. She wouldn't do that to Basil. She there was some kind of misunderstanding. She's not the same anymore, Hero. She's become all messed up after you left for college. Aubrey. What happened while I was gone? Maybe I should have never left. It's not your fault this happened. Things could have got a lot worse if you didn't show up. You've done all you can. Come on, let's go home. All right. I wanna know. I wanna know. I wanna know why. I wanna know why Aubrey hates him so bad. I've been taking care of Basil for two years already, but I barely know anything about him. Wish you open up about himself more. Just wanna help. You know, Sonny, you're pretty awesome back there. Jumping into the lake to save Basil like that. Even if he were ended up saving a day, I think you deserve some recognition too. How about a high five? Okay, bro. Oh. I am sensing an evil presence coming from inside my home! Maybe I'm overthinking it. But I can never be too careful. Can I go in now? An evil presence, huh? Interesting. Mm. Evil presence. Curtain. Cactus. Well, this is obviously his room. Look at that bitch with his little... Look at that bitch with his little mannequin wig holders, bro. Okay. Since when am I Captain Save a Why am I going to investigate the evil presence? A holy book. Oh. Cardboard cutouts of a pair of twins. There's something stuck on the back. You find a note. Seems if we've gone missing. We couldn't have gotten too far. Find us, dear little brother. Signed, Daphne and Boeing, your loving older siblings. Uh, what the fuck? What the fuck do I got going on right now? Are they in a plant? That would be hilarious. Alright. So am I trying to find these niggas now? Uh. Oh, pillows. You turn over the rug, find two fluffy pillows. There's a note on the back. It's the oldest trick in the book. I can't believe you actually fall for this. Sign Daphne Bond, your loving older siblings. All right. Am I supposed to go get Michael and do this? <laughs> Looked under the bed, but you did not find anything of interest. Open the cabinet doors. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You did not find anything of interest except the fucking ya. Yeah. Checked under the table. You did not find anything of interest. All right. How did I get sidetracked? Uh. Ha! Got you good, didn't we? Uh, hey, wait a second. You're not our darling little brother. Mm hmm. Little brother's too cool for us now, isn't he, Bowen? Hasn't even had his time to play games with his loving older siblings anymore. Yes, Daphne. It is very regrettable. <sighs> we barely get any time off work, and when we do, little Michael is never around to play with us anymore. It's unfair, isn't it, Bowen? Life is so cruel. Well, that's fine. Now we have some new friends. Though, not exactly sure what they do. Entertain us, dear friends. Yes, entertain us. Uh. Ho oh, hum! You got nothing? That's too bad. Well, this is all very fun, but we get bored quite easily. Come, brother. Let us think of more fun games to play. Goodbye, new friends. This has been pleasant. Uh, was that the evil presence? Ah, so you have conquered the great evil. What did it cost you? 
I can still see the pain in your eyes. My brother and sister are real drag, aren't they? Everyone here is the same. Damn, dude. What just happened? Boy, I thought my niggas just got creased by that damn car for a second. The dog den is fucking glowing. You want to play with Hector? Sure. What am I even playing with him? Oh, fetch. I'm like, he's a nigga just spinning around. <coughs> Excuse me. Keep him moving. Who ripped that fucking teddy bear in half? Kel! Hero! Where have you been? So late, I've been worried sick. Sorry, mom. We got held up. The good news is we found Basil and he's safe. Hmm. I'll have you know, I spent all week preparing the chicken roast for you tonight's dinner, huh? And it's gotten cold. Oh, mom, please don't cry. Don't worry, mom. That's what microwaves are for. Oh, my poor dinner. Okay. There and there, honey, cheer up. Today's a special day. There's no need to be sad. Look, he goes back from college. Good to see you back, champ. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> oh, your dad's right. This is no time for sniffles. <laughs> it's good to see you back, hero. We've all missed you so much. We <laughs> Ah, sounds like Sally's awake. I'll go get her. All right. Come on, boys. You must be hungry. Go on and help yourselves to dinner. Hey. Hey. Cool, let's go grab some food and heat it up. Mmm. Yeah. Mmm. You got a home cooked meal, but it's cold. You get up using the microwave. Woo! Now that things calm down, we can relax a bit. So good to see you again, Sonny. Really has been way too long. Oh, and it's good to see you again, too, Kale. So, Sonny, I heard from Mom that you're moving away soon. Sounds exciting. Yeah, he is. Tomorrow's gonna be his last day with us. Well, it might seem kind of nerve-wracking now, but it really isn't so bad once you get used to it. I think it'd be good for you. Hmm. You learn a lot moving to a new place. It's nice to have a fresh start. I'm a little sad to see you go, but it'll be okay. As long as we keep in touch. Oh, there's some Chloe and Maxine shit, for sure. <sighs> we sure did have a lot of memories together. Sometimes I miss those days. Lazing around, eating food, drinking juice. Yeah, we did everything together. Went to the park, the lake, the beach. Honestly, what I miss the most is hanging out at your place, honey. You guys had everything. A big TV, all the newest toys, a grand piano, and of course, our very own treehouse. Oh yeah, the treehouse was awesome. I wonder if it's still there. Is it, Sonny? I don't know. It's like the food's done. Let's eat in the living room. We can teach you how They keep ripping apart them fucking teddy bears. What is that about? Microwave. By the way, Hero, uh, Basil gave Sonny his photo album yesterday. Did you want to see it? You have Basil's photo album on you? Uh, sure, let's look Let's look through how we eat dinner. That nigga do not want to see Mary Mara's face, bro. Alright. Oh, did they purposely take her pictures out so he wouldn't be reminded? It looked like it. Oh, yeah, they took her pictures out. <laughs> you don't look at the photo album? Yeah. It's too bad some photos are missing. I already stole the album from Basil, but we got it back. Maybe she has the rest of the photos. Hmm. Hey, Hero, what's up? You okay? Yeah. It's just that, well, Myanmar isn't in any of these photos. Oh, you're right. She isn't. Still, this album really brings back some good memories, don't it? Things were a lot simpler when we were kids. <laughs> Sonny, I have a favor to ask. I think you could let us see your house one more time before we leave? Oh, before you leave, my fault. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. But you gotta convince mom first. She probably's gonna be kind of mad about you not spending enough time with her and stuff. You know how she is. <laughs> Is 
Mikhail's dad, also Vance's dad, they're the same person. Whew, what a mess that was. Sally made a little doo-doo. She's all clean now. Please. Uh. Peekaboo! Hey there, Sally. <laughs> Stop it, Kel, you're scaring her. Uh, so, uh, hey, mom, we were wondering if we could go out at Sunny's house today since he's moving away soon. Oh? But you just came back, and it's already so late, and I'm spending time with your mom. I'm gonna be here for the rest of the summer, and Sunny is leaving the day after tomorrow. We have plenty of time to catch up. I think it's okay for here to spend some time with Kel and Sunny. I haven't seen Sunny around for a long time. It's been a while since the boys have had a chance to hang out. I say we should let them. <sighs> Fine then. You boys can have your fun. But Hero has to wash the dishes when he uh when when he gets them for next week. Yep. Sh sure. Guess I could do that. Hmm. All right. You're free to go. Come on, Sally. Let's leave your mean old brothers alone. They don't want anything to do with us, do they, Sally? Damn. Oh, mom. Papa. Don't fret about your mother too much, Hero. She misses you, that's all. She'll feel better after she calms down. You guys go off and do your thing. I'll make sure she's okay. I'm give her this. Yep, I gotta stop. Hey, so I'm really glad that we got to hang out and everything. But I also feel pretty bad about leaving Mom alone. Before we head to your house, let's go to Fixin' and get some flowers for her. I didn't know she really appreciated it. Oh, Hero. Always a mama's boy. Well... Let's go handle a bin ass. Wow. Fuck that mean. I'm not talking to that stinky fuck back there. It's not happening. Go over here. Another stink. Anya is dancing. That one dancing. I don't know what he got going on. Shit. What's that the hangout? Now that I know I could go back there and shit. Found a seashell. Okay. Well, alright. I thought something cool was gonna be back here. Somebody said, bro, you just picked up a, she a seashell. It's the rarest thing in the game that you can ever achieve. My fault. My fault. I didn't mean to anger you with my ignorance. Let me out this bitch game. All right. What was that? I mean, it was someone with their leg. Don't tell me I've been stood up. That's fucked up. Hey. Hey. No more freestyles. No more, bro. No more. <laughs> oh, God. Um, what's her name? I forget this girl's name. Missy is diligently sketching away. Missy, okay. So what flowers you want to get? Flowers. Maybe I have to go talk to the person. Welcome to Fix It, where you can buy stuff and fix it yourself. What are you interested in? Oops, before I forget. Sonny, here's some money from my mom's flowers. You didn't think I would let you pay for it, did you? You got $10 from Euro. Wow. Uh, flowers. How many would you like? Like, two, three, I guess. How's this? That'd be $6. Awesome, I'll get that pack for you right away. Maybe, maybe, maybe one more. Maybe one more. I was gonna love these flowers. Let's drop them off in my little no, 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 Sunny. Show that. Two, four, six, eight. How many did I buy? Eight. So I saved two dollars. Hero gonna be like, bro, give me my. <laughs> Alright, bro. How do I get home again? Well, to his home. I think it's this way. My little niggas itching. We gonna take out our. Uh, better not play the field. Pussies, I'm gonna have my dog sick. Of. Hmm. It's getting kinda late. Should probably head to your house after this. Sound good to you? Yeah. Why not? Mama Dukes. They about to be in here rocking the boat. Knock first. Oh, they good. They good. <laughs> oh, God. Dude. Okay, bro. Hey, Mom. Got you some flowers. Uh oh. Are these for me? They're beautiful. Thank you. Ah. You know, you're such a charmer. Just like your old man. Nah. Sorry for overreacting earlier. I know Sonny's moving away soon. Try your best to keep in touch. Friends are harder to make the older you get. Mom, that's so fucking depressing, but it's true though. We'll be fine. Might not be. Yes, I'm sure you will be. I'm not. Take care, Sonny. Know that you'll always have a home here. Sally up there doing uh, donuts. Oh, bro, she up there drifting. How as a human do you learn how to drift yourself in that fast to get dark? Uh, wow, just hit me. It's been so long since we've seen the inside of your house, even though we live right next door. Time really flies, huh? Yeah, it sure does. Um, let's go inside. After you, Sonny. 
Uh. My power off. Uh. Wow, this place is cleared out, Sonny. That feels a lot bigger now that nothing's here. <coughs> Excuse me. Used to be a couch here where we watch TV. We all come over every weekend and watch cartoons in the morning. Yeah, and this is the stain from that one time I spilled my orange Joe. Me and Mario got so mad at me. Well, that's because their cat stepped in and it walked all over the house. <laughs> oh, yeah. Huh? Oh, man. It's like it's getting too dark to go to the street house. That's okay. Maybe we can come back tomorrow. Wait, I have an idea. What if we just stay over for the night? It's gonna be our last time in this house forever, right? And what will the next time we can spend a night with Sunny be like? Um, hmm. I love to, but Mom's not gonna be too happy about it. She'll be fine. I'm tired of waking up at night because Sally's always crying anyway. You're gonna wash the dishes with Mom for an entire week, aren't you? You deserve this. Well, that's true. Probably be fine. Live right next door, so we'll only be a walk away. Well, y'all could still try it. That bitch refuses to go out there. He got a body back there. That's what that is. <laughs> that nigga Omori got a body back there. Look at that ghost in the window. See what I'm saying? It's like you still got some choices to do before moving away, sonny. Don't worry, I can handle it. Never know what to do with myself in the mornings anyway. Just think of it as a parting gift. Wow. There's a fucking demon in the window. And we gonna act like we didn't see that. All right. I remember this hallway. The closet was to the left. The piano room was to the right. What if the piano was still there? I'll go ahead and see. Don't judge me too hard. I haven't practiced in a while. Show off. Ha! <laughs> Guess I still got it. Hey, Sonny, that reminds me. You still play the violin? Hell nah. Oh, it's not here. Guess you already packed it up. There's a song you used to play with me and Mari. Still gets stuck in my head sometimes, but I don't remember what it's called. You two will play it over and over. We'd even hear it from my house sometimes. What was it again? Uh, I don't know. I mean, still remember how to play all good and stuff. I can barely even read sheet music anymore. Yeah. And all of a sudden, I'm getting really sleepy. Maybe we should call it a night. That sounds good to me. I had to get up early for my morning jog anyway. So where should we sleep, Sonny? Probably somewhere in your room, right? I remember you used to hate sleeping alone. Yeah, this sounds fun. We can sleep on the floor if anything. Let's go find some blankets. Hold on, Kel, wait for me. I'm about to be alone in this bitch, ain't I? Yeah, I knew that. Well, it's okay. Oh, God. Miramar. Okay. I'm not just too hard for you to sleep comfortably. Yeah, let me save. When I start seeing her in places, I get I get it get dangerous. She's scary. Look at that demon in the window. Look at that demon in the window. You cannot tell me that's not a being. And it's a being that only I see. These niggas Okay, bro. Answer machine. I showed an answer that bitch. Hey, Sonny, we put the bed for it. Hope you don't mind. This was all Kel's idea. I had nothing to do with it. By the way, Hero, Sonny and I got you a gift. Kel gave Hero's gift to Hero. It's Papa Chip's chip off the old block cookbook. You remember this? Of course I do. And I remember when I wanted to be a cook. It seems so silly now. Hey, you're pretty good at it. And you could still be a cook, Hero. Uh, it's okay. I don't have the time for that anymore. But, you really like to cook, don't you? People have to eat, right? So, like, why not? Huh. <laughs> I don't think it works that way, Kill. <sighs> that bitch just made me sleepy. I'm not even sleepy. I just woke up. He just made me yawn. He's such a fast sleeper, bro. Always been that way, I guess. Thanks for letting us sleep over, Sonny. Bet it'd be pretty hard in this empty house, especially without Mary Mari. Sorry I couldn't be there for you more. Things feel so different now. But it seems like you pretty much stayed the same. 
It's kind of relieving, to be honest. It's <laughs> really nice to see you again, gang. Just wish Aubrey and Basil could be here, too. Anyway, sorry for renting. It's getting late. I'll probably have to sleep soon, too. Good night, Sunny. I'll talk to you in the morning. I wonder, can I leave outside? Now he don't want to go in there. Okay. I was like, how can, how have I never been in that room before? But it's because he denies that shit. Well, guess I'll just go to sleep then. There's no room for you. <laughs> yeah. All right. Very comfortable bed. Would you like to go to sleep? Yeah. Now, is it going to be the actual dream sleep or, you know, one of them sleeps? Well, what do you mean by one of them sleeps? Like, like a sleep where you just wake up in the real world again or are you actually about to dream? Murder, murder, kill, kill, murder, kill, kill, murder, kill, kill, murder, murder, murder. See, see, it took him. It took him, see? See, it took him, see? Ain't no sunny no more, just straight evil. Straight demon. Uh, that big ass nya. Hmm. Oh, that bitch locked the door. The door is locked. Hey, that bitch locked the door. He's like, that motherfucker not getting me. Little do you know you are that. That is you. Sit sit it Waiting for something to happen? I'm not sure. I've been locked out of the white space. Well, just investigating everything before I... All right. Well, yep, everybody gone. Just as I suspected. Some nutritious candy. Would you like to eat some? You feel better. Um, where were they at? I can't even remember where they were at. Where were they just at? I can't remember where they were just at. I think I'm gonna just go to Basil's house. Fuck it. Thick fog envelops the entire forest. So you're not going that way? Okay. The floating mirror. You are all alone. You wanna play hide and seek? Sure. See what happens. Five, four, three, two, jump scare. Okay, we good. Go! I'm playing hide and seek with the fucking mirror. Where is that bitch at? What? Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay, bro. Found you. Wanna play again? Nah, I'm good. Well, nothing to do here. Let's go back up. Let's go to the east side. A thick fog. Yep, okay. Thick fog envelops the entire forest. What's happening, bro? Hmm. I ain't never been up here, I don't think. Who's that? Oh, okay, Miri. Amori, you're here. I'm so glad you found me. Kel, Aubrey, and Hero, and all the children are gone. Oh, them niggas took a plunge off the edge. I forgot. There's a thick fog enveloping the entire forest. Everywhere except here. Maybe our friends are somewhere across the water. Let's find them together. You want to join me? Sure. Thanks, little brother. I knew I could count on you. I'll keep you company so you're not alone. No, you really hate that. All right. <laughs> Steady your heartbeat. Don't be afraid. It's not as scary as you think. Well, we knew that was her talking to us in the real game. We knew that was her, but, um, you know, you are no longer afraid of drowning. Okay, so that means I could go back to that west side shit. Hope the water's warm before you get motherfucking um, hypothermia. Don't like that music. What is the siren in these waters? Back up. Who is that? Basil? Uh, they only got the same shape as Basil. These are just souls. I wonder can it get me. Okay, I was just trying some shit. There is nothing here. Okay. Well, just making sure. Just was trying something. Okay, them bitches leave when you get close. Oh, shit. What is that? Oh, what the fuck is this? An ordinary houseplant. Leaves are hard and brittle. You found dead batteries. Okay. Something stares at you from the other side of the screen. 
That's not fun. Dirty wardrobes, empty inside. An unmade bed. Hasn't been used in years. Stool on his side. Well, let's get the fuck up out of here before whatever that is jumps out that motherfucking TV. And tries to remove us. Mm-hmm. Motherfucker, start taking your fingertips away. Fingernail first, though. Yeah, excruciating pain. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Stop it? How? Okay, here we go. I don't really think that I'm supposed to be down here. I don't know why I did that. Just being adventurous, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't supposed to get down here. I fucking hate that sound, though. It ain't shit over there, either. Alright. Oh. Mori, I'm so proud of you. You swim all the way here, even though you've always been terrified of water. There's still one big thing you're afraid of, isn't there? Something a little bit harder to overcome. D-E-A-T-H? Maybe. K-I-L-L? -L? Potentially. M-U-R-D-E-R? -E what is that? Demon Whisper? I, I would be scared of that too. Oh my gosh. Look at my friends. They're not my friends anymore. I murdered them. <laughs> Don't laugh at that joke, bro. Did y'all just hear the souls laughing at me? It's not funny. Um... Alright, bro. I'ma stop making the murder jokes. I'ma stop I'ma just I'ma stop saying Mori's a killer, but that's what it's looking like a little bit. Just a little bit. Just a little bit, gang. So these are the places that we was taking the pictures at? It's just physical manifestations of it? Maybe. It looked like cause that's the that was the umbrella picture, wasn't it? I think so. Obviously I'm not gonna be able to tell it was a watermelon picture, but that one looked like the umbrella one. Okay, maze. Good to know. Fucking hate maze. Ooh. Well, um, I can't do anything with that, huh? Oh! That bitch gonna run away. I looked at it too long. Slenderman, good to know. My back hurts. Eee. What? Why don't I just sing an EE -E song? I'm not Jacquees. This is the, um, this is the piano room cur curtain. Omori. Seems that you've forgotten something important. Are you okay with that? I'm not too sure. Uh, you've seen this curtain once before. Last time we went to the lake. This is my stop, though. I know I shouldn't have come. This gets a little lonely without everyone. It's not my place to say anymore, but... I hope you're still there, Sonny. I really miss you. That nigga just got took. I watched it happen before we entered this world. Goodbye, little brother. Uh. uh. The fuck is that? What did I just do? What just happened? Uh. This is the sound of me drowning. Okay. Sonic. Anglerfish. Why is it crying? I ain't never seen a crying anglerfish before. Ooh, that one's nasty. Good to know. Good to know that they get nastier. M. Mmm. Is the M for Miri Mari? That bitch might not even pop up on my hangman sheet, though. Seven keys left. Interact with the hole. There's a hole here. Reach into the hole? Yeah, see what happened. I knew it. You felt someone hold your hand. Wow. Perfect. Waiting for something to happen. Hmm. Uh. Virus. Get it off my screen. <laughs> oh my god. Dolphin. Centipede? I don't know what that one is over there. Toll. This lane's carpool only, kid. Come back when you've got friends. <laughs> okay, you fucking gator bitch. 
Fuck you. Puss ass nigga. We found one clam. Oh, well, thanks. That one look kind of cool. White and red. Okay, well, at least they can't fight me. The cars aren't even moving. Hey, kid, you want to go somewhere cool? You should go to the last resort. It's the hottest, trendiest place these days. I can say that if you want. It's all the rage. Come on. Don't be shy. I don't bite much. Not right now. I'm probably going to end up there anyway, but I think I'd rather run there. I'm not getting in the car with a gator that talks shit to me. Ah! Endless highway. Okay, you got jokes. Basically, you're saying that this shit doesn't... Uh, well, no, it's going, it's going, it's keep going, it's keeping it going, it's keeping it going. But you're saying I might as well get in that cab because it's not going to stop? Is that what you're saying to me or am I tripping? I think that's what you're saying to me. You want to ride back to the deep? Well, I'll drive you as much as you want. Ain't that big a deal to me. I can pay a salary. No, let me go to the last resort. It's a terrifying name, but I ain't pussy. Hey, let's go. Fuck it. See what's, let's see what's the word. Let's see what the word is. Oh. A little bumpy, but not all that bad. Come back anytime, kid. Uh. There go Kello. Hey, Amori, there you are. Where have you been, buddy? While well, you were gone, everyone got tricked into signing contracts. So, we have jobs now. Growing up so fast. My job is to point people to the last resort. That's where I work. Uh, what am I looking at? There it is. Uh, hmm. well, there was Miri Mari again. Well, not Mari Mari, but Miri Mari. Okay, well, I'll make that I'll make that distinguish so it's easier for listeners. But I gotta say, this job isn't all this cut out to be. So why don't we get everyone to quit and get the fuck out of here? He's been traveling a lot for work lately. And I know for sure that Arby's working on the fifth floor at the last resort. So we should go find her first. Uh, all right. It's like a job for Aubrey, but I do not have, I do not have an Aubrey. What are you? Hey, you. Yes, you there with the stoic expression. You like, you want some fresh pow, pause. Uh, I don't, I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. I, you know what? Maybe. I'm curious. No, no, I'm fine. I'm fine, actually. I'm, 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 I think I'm okay. Yeah, I don't want any milk from, I don't want no milk from no nigga. I don't know what that means. Are these poster boards? Is that Peter Griffin? Don't none of these bitches got no booty. <laughs> uh, all right. Let's keep it moving. Hey, Mary Mari, look who finally decided to show up. Amori! It's good to see you again. Hmm? What is it, Amori? Aren't you happy to see your big sister? Oh, that's just Amori being Amori. I can't blame him for the way he looks. Anyway, as I was just saying, working pays the bills, but it's not very exciting. So me and Amori are gonna get Aubrey Hero, and then we're gonna find Basil? Oh yeah, that's what we were gonna do. <laughs> Always happy to help. Let me know if you need anything else, okay? Nah, no, don't worry about it, uh, me and Amori. The boss loves me. We'll be in and out of the last resort real quick, no problem. Okay, if you say so, Kale. Uh, come on, Amari. I can't wait for you to meet the boss. He's awesome. He's a bitch. I'm already knowing you're a bitch. Well, let's go see what folks talking about. Hey! Hey! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh. Uh. Uh, this the last resort, I don't play with no whore, yeah This the last resort, I don't play with no whore, yeah Verse 1 Uh, we gotta go tree Aubrey, but I don't know where she at in this ha mm. I don't know where she at in this establishment But I know that she in this bitch and she he heaven sent for Omori Cause he a demon, he needs something to Verse 2 
Uh, me and Kale doing well I jump down that well And I talk to my sister down there She in hell I don't know why though Probably cause she accomplishments And my, uh, my bravado Is where I get it Uh, she the reason why I'm spitting She the reason that I really feeling like I get it yeah, I get what? Get that my nigga is a murderer on this screen. He got a knife. That's the uh, 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 stereotypical thing of a, yeah. Stereotypical thing of a, yeah. Stereotypical thing of a killer. If you wanna play with me, nigga, I get bigger. I ain't talking about kill with the flex, nigga. What? That almost sounded racist. But I'm black, so it's okay. Uh, where the fuck is our girl, Aubrey? Yeah, I ain't talking about that nigga Drake. Uh, don't involve me in that shit, I'm just joking. Not no J. Colin. Uh, shout out to that nigga Dreamville. Can I see you at the top of the hill? That's me up there, you down there, I'm looking down. Uh, but I ain't talking down, I'm that nigga though. Uh, if you play with me, I got more. I'll put holes in your mother though. Why her? Cause she gave birth to your stupid ass. Put your ass in the grass, then cover it up with some dirt and mud. Uh, I gotta lock in for verse three. I gotta lock in for verse three. Yeah. Uh, I know we got a fine hero, but he across the world, I don't really see a Negro. Yeah, except for me in this bitch. W O N puts respect in this bitch. Yeah, and if I play, I get croc. It's like four of them bitches, and they do shit, knock, knock you down like a uh, sound. Boom, yeah, sonic boom now. Fighter jet speed when I fly past these things. When I do it quick, I do it quickly. Alright, alright. Nose goes. Alright. Ah! Alright, pal, you're not making it past me this time. What is wrong with him? I ain't never had no issue with this nigga before. This giving Jersey beat. It's uh, giving jersey, I don't play with no her I don't really play with no bitch, I got girl Gun, that's what I mean, not the N at the er Hold on, I'm about to restart Uh, niggas wanna play Uh, niggas wanna play, they die today Give a fuck about a croc, I make leather out you reptile bitches And I put it on my, yeah And I put it on my pants, yeah And I put it on my hands, gloves That's what I'ma hit your ass with when I sp Hmm. Kel is playing slots. He lost a hundred. This nigga losing my money. This nigga is taking my money, bro. Kel, you are a fucking fool. I'm losing money behind his stupid ass, boy. Oh my god. That bitch won 90. Okay. If I end this game with anything less than 9,500, if I end this battle with anything less than 9,500, that's your ass, Kel. I'm telling you. I gained 600 XP for Okay, so I got my shit back, though. I was about to get mad, gang. Nah, you serious? Not again. Don't worry about it. That won't be a problem. So why only some... Like, why only some of them won't beef? And he chased me far! And he chased me far! Stop! That bitch chased me far! What the fuck? Uh, no hole there, huh? What is that thing? Yo, ho, ho! Another win for me. Today's my lucky day. Take these clams. I don't need them. I'm rich. I'm rich. So are you. Uh, what is that over there? All right, bro. My sisters and I own a small cafe on the highway east of here. You should check it out. The food is delicious. Uh, uh bitch, you all the way up there. You can't even get me. Look at him. You can't even get me. Back up. Hey, you. Here's you there with the store. Can I issue with some honest... Alright, no. Humma, humma. I'm counting... If I'm counting this right, then... Humma, humma. Ah! Alright, bro. <laughs> See, I thought since he didn't... Okay. I, I thought since he didn't, like, chase me, that he was cool. So I wanted to see what he was... Alright, bro. Oh, Mori. This is probably not a good time, but I really have to go to the bathroom. As I always say, when you gotta go, you gotta go. Alright, bro. I just seen the bathroom, too. 
Now, I don't know where I seen it. Look at him, back up. What is that, Squilliam? Day in, day out, it's all the same. Whatever, it's a job, I guess. At least I would, mm, yeah. Oh, come on. Hold on, Amari, this will just take a minute. And then they put pee on the toilet like urine. Ah, much better. You know this kid didn't wash his hands. All right. All right, bro. All right, bro. There's a hole right there. Reach into it. Oh, that nigga said go into it. Oh. Basil's photo album. Scribble, scrabble. Scribble, scrabble. Ooh. Oh, Basil, this is what you did, huh? Or did I do this? I mean, if he, this is what he did, then it'll explain why Aubrey was mad at him. But I've seen these pictures already, so I can't really leave this circle, though. Can't interact with anything outside these pictures. Uh, and then it disappeared. All right, well, I'm gonna keep it moving. I need health, honestly. Stop! Thanks. Goodness gracious. Isn't this a cool elevator? It smells kind of like perfume and smoke. Uh. Oh, hi, Miramar. Hello, you two. Let's see now. So if I got this straight, Arby's on the fifth floor. Excuse me. Why isn't this working? Oh yeah, I totally forgot! We need a cool key card for this! Oh my gosh, they took mine away because I kept losing it. I swear they're disappearing on their own though! Let's try looking around the other floors for one. There's gotta be a cool key card around here somewhere. Okay, well, let me heal first. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. I'll attempt to look for this new key card. Look how much fucking damage I took, bro. That's what's fucking with me, gang. Hot dog. Get your hot dog here. Cost you a honey clams. Come on, they yummy. You got a hot dog. Oh. Thanks. I guess I'll eat that. Pause. Uh, pocket. Snacks. Hot dog. Here's a hundred heart. Oh, you snap. You snap. Can I buy some more game? They only a hundred dollars? What? I'm about to stash up on that. You tweaking. How many do I got now? I should have like four, right? Yeah. Yeah, nigga. What is that? A cactus shark? A shark pickle. Do you want to learn a fact about sharks and or pickles? If you give me a combo meal, I'll tell you what I know. So you a hungry bitch. Okay. There's another. There's an axolotl up there. What you talking about, gang? I didn't get to your computer. I traveled all the way from the wide, wide web to hack your files. I will lock you in this DLL forever. Like, okay, Kenito, move around. Do you want to play slots? I, I, I want to figure out what this, this stingray is. I'm sick of slots, but there's not much else to do around here. Let's just go back to the city. Look at that bitch. You can't even get me. Hey, look, look at that bitch. You can't even get me. Puss ass nigga. Puss ass nigga. Move. You don't, you don't get it like that, nigga. Uh, uh. This bitch just trapped me. Why are you even sitting right here? You just trapped me. This is as far as you go. Mr. Johnson ain't gonna be happy to see you. What beats, uh, sad, right? Yeah, um, doesn't particularly matter, I don't think, but... That bitch lost 96 of my clams, bro. He's selling. That bitch is selling, bro. And he's selling bad. He's selling bad. The fuck off my screen. Look at this. I'm literally trapped right here. Who said you could leave your post? Get back to work. Uh, fuck you. Uh, what would Omori do? Uh, I guess you could just attack this bitch. He's regular right now. <laughs> okay. Wow. His follow-up attack is a little double slice now. Good shit. Okay, bro. See what I'm saying? There's two of you now? Wait till the boss gets a load of this. Oh, my God. Damn. I just fucked him up, though. I ain't gonna lie. Did y'all see that? Pink beard? The joint just ain't cut out for these folks. And I'm making them. These folks, um, this joint just ain't cut out like these folks are making it out to be. I want my class back, Arab. 
I be trying the New Orleans accent. That shit don't be hitting right, but I still be trying it though. <laughs> I want my class back, you hear me? <laughs> oh my god. Somebody said my accent is not a joke. Quit laughing. Motherfucker. I'm not even trying to play, bro. You right, gang. I'm not trying to play with you, gang. Um, now, since ain't no niggas chasing me, I should be able to find this fucking thing. An owl? God, how'd I get myself into this dump? This is one thing after another this week. Alright, bro. Where the fuck is this damn card? I'm out to Google it. What is that? This place is amazing! I'm having the time of my life! Alright, well... I wonder, can I heal or will they come back? If I heal and they come back, I might just get off. Uh, I might find the key and then just get off. If these niggas are back, I'm done. Okay, they back, bro. Um, I'm about to, I'm about to find this key and then I'm getting off. I didn't even know that I could use the elevator. You know what? I didn't even know that I could use the elevator. I didn't even know that I could use the elevator. I thought it was implied... I, obviously, I read that wrong as shit. I thought it was implied that I can't use the elevator without, um... Without a key at all. I thought I couldn't use the elevator at all, but... I can still go to the second floor. How did you get up here? Clean in the clean in the clean in the clean. All right. I want to give flowers to someone, but he's only interested in puzzles. If only I could. Okay, I remember you. All right. You got a cool key card. Cool. We found a cool key card. Should have to get to the fifth floor from the elevator now. Let's go find Aubrey. All right, bro. Boss tried to put me to use. When he realized I couldn't do anything, he told me to be a bed tester. Hmm. Yep. Bed sure feels good. What is that? A doll with an empty face. Doesn't look like it belong here. Would you like to throw it away? No. That nigga wanted to be there, didn't let him be there. I don't, you know? Let him be cool. He ain't hurting nobody. Let's go to the third floor, see what's popping. Brand new whip, just hopped in. I got options. I passed that bitch like Stockton. Just Jocelyn. Spend that time they locked in. My boy got rid of the toxins. We decided to come here on a honeymoon because they offered a free room and luxury resort experience. Luxury my ass. This place is as shoddy as it gets. Can already see the paint coming off the walls. Honestly, I don't mind this place at all. It's not bad at all for being free. Even if the kiddie pool outside is haunted. Yep, all right. Look at this nigga, man. Hey, kids, I'm the Life Jam guy. I sell Life Jam. It really works. Would you like to buy some Life Jam? It only costs you 250 clams. Thanks, sir. Yeah, Life Jam. Life Jam! It really works. You got clam corn. The fuck is that? Oh, my sweet sins are so hard. <laughs> you better not be causing him any trouble. Or else. I'll smack you all the way to tomorrow. I've been fucking your sons up. Dead ass sons. Dead ass bitch. Yep, I've been fucking them niggas up. Play with me if you want to. Well, I thought that was a blunt. So I bumped into mom on the way up here, and she won't stop nagging me. Wearing shades inside is bad for your eyes, she says. Can't take off these shades just like that. You're like a part of me. Man, mom's visiting again? She must be empty nesting hard. What? Mom's here? I gotta go say hi later. Uh. Really? For the extra hard nights. Okay. What is that? Okay. See, obviously I'm doing too much. Ah, yes, a very long hero sandwich. Pause. I feel like I'm gonna immediately pause that one. Friends feel like no good shit. Let's go get Aubrey. I'm not here to fucking kick it with y'all. Why is there a floating face? I'm, uh, you know what? Let's just get, get Aubrey. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look who we have here. You're trying to talk to the big boss, are you? Sorry to burst your bubble, but I can't just let anyone through here willy nilly. Ah, oh, man, really? Come on, bro. We've known each other forever. You can't do us a small little favor. Sorry, Kel. It's the boss's orders. Today's a big day, so he don't want any disturbances. You got a tofu fundraiser to pay for tonight. But, Broly, it's me. Your old friend, Kel. Yeah, you go way back. Think of all our good times together, man. Hey, quit it. They made me add a security for a reason. They wanted someone tough. Someone who can make the hard decisions. A hard-headed person. I mean, look at my badge. So shiny. Hmm. Quick, Kel, think of something fast. Why well, I know. Hey, Burley. Our girlfriend Amori here is interested in a job. You know the boss would never turn down free work. Hmm, that is true, but... Please, Burley. Please, 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 please. Oh, all right. I'll let you through this time. But only if you give me some bottled water first. I'm parched. All right, bro. And then I'll assume that I'm gonna eventually have to get some fucking milk, too. Yeah, I'm supposed to let niggas nut on me. Good to know. Where did that motherfucker... I don't even know. 
I don't even know. Hopefully it's to the first floor. Basement? No, 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 no. Too low. Yeah, you know what the store is. Guys, you know what I'm saying? We got 400 clams is crazy, gang. 400 clams is crazy, gang. Damn. That's hell of a lot of business. Boy, I almost just put my finger dead in my eye. I almost put my finger dead in my eye, Joe. Oh my gosh. Hey, you gave me some bottle of water? Thanks, all you want. Come on, boys. I already got pizza in the bake room. Break room. All right, free pizza. Uh, I hope there aren't any pineapples on it. You a bitch ass nigga for that die. You a bitch ass nigga for that die. If you don't like pineapples on your pizza, get from around me. If you don't like pineapples on your pizza, get from around me. If you don't like pineapples on your pizza, get from around me. I said with my chest, nigga. I said with my chest, nigga. The main motherfuckers that say that it'd be the main motherfuckers that ain't even tried it, though. That's what killed me, concierge. What is this thing? What is this? Uh, so Johnson has a new bodyguard who's real tough, but there's no way he's gonna be a match for touchdown. Hello? Please hold. Hello? Please hold. Hello? Please hold. Aubrey! We're to break you out. Dang it, Kel. Go away. Can't you see I'm busy? Snap out of it, Aubrey. This isn't who you are. You know three people canceled their meetings today? Three people. I'm supposed to reschedule them, but I don't even know how this is going to fit with all these useless events planned. Not to mention, we have a fundraiser tonight. And of all things, it's a tofu fundraiser. Who in their right mind would pay clams for tofu? I tried telling the boss so many times, but he just won't listen. This is a complete nightmare. Yeah, okay, Aubrey. I'm going to need you to breathe. I'm breathing, Kel. I'm breathing just fine! Deep breaths, Aubrey. Deep breaths. Ooh, hee. Ooh, hee. You are not a secretary. Ooh, hee. Basil is missing and we need to find him. Ooh, hee. Ooh, hee. Ooh, hee. Ooh, hee. My goodness, that's right. How could I forget? You have to find Basil. Oh, more is that you? Okay. He must be here to save me. I'm so happy. Wait, what about me? Amor, you have to get me out of here. We can just leave. We can just leave, Aubrey. The exit's right there. It's not that simple, Kel. You signed contracts, remember? Uh, Aubrey. Aubrey! Where have you been? I've been trying to get a hold of you for the past 10 seconds. How's that rescheduling going? Sorry, Jawsome. Something came up. Get off my dick. All right, Mr. Jawsome. Dang it. You again, Kale? Thought we sent you far, far away from here. Didn't I tell you not to leave your post? Well, I came all the way back personally to tell you that I fucking quit. And I'm bringing Aubrey with me. Very funny. My office, Kale. Now. Yeah, I'll send him right away. You too, Aubrey. Z okay. Dang it, Kale. You're gonna get me fired. I know, isn't this great? Uh, come on, let's go. This is Joss office right up this elevator. Okay, well. Hey. Okay. God damn, how far up is he? Stop, stop that. <sighs> oh my goodness. Alright, bro, let's go talk to the bitch. Ah, you're finally here. Hi, Mr. Jossum. <clears throat> Alright, kids, so let me lay this down for you. As the contract states here, you have agreed to work for me, for better or for worse, without pay for the rest of your life. Now, a contract is a promise. Hey, you wouldn't break a promise, would you? Shoot, he's right. You can't break a promise. What do we do, Aubrey? Mr. Jossum. It's true that we didn't make a promise. Is it true that me didn't make a promise to you? But we also promised each other that we'd find our friend Basil together. Uh, yeah, that's right. That means you have to let us go. Hmm. I guess I can respect that. A promise is a promise. Aubrey, I'll let you leave. But you have to take care with you. Really? 
Wow, thanks, Mr. Johnson. You're too kind. Awesome, let's go. Wait, I feel like I'm forgetting something. Oh, yeah, can we bring my brother Hero with me, too? Yeah, you really are a funny kid, Kill. You want me to give you Hero? That's rich. Rich, I tell you. Hero is fins down the best worker I've ever hired in my life. His very presence increases my work output by 700%. I'd be a fool to let go of a worker like him. Uh. Hey, Mr. Johnson, I just finished setting the TOEFL fundraise like you asked. The tables are set, the room is decorated, the toilets are clean, and the food tastes spectacular if I do say so myself. I also cleaned your windows, mopped your floors, fed your pets, organized your sunglass collection, and folded your laundry. Special attention to them jaws. Oh, and here's your coffee. Just thought you'd enjoy that. You see, kids? Amazing work, hero. Just amazing. I'm ready because see you paying what you need. Really? That'd be an honor, sir. Oh, hey, guys. What are you doing here? You looking for a job, too, Amori? Uh. Hero, what happened to you? Don't tell me that even you forgot about Basil. Oh, shoot. That's right. We need to find Basil. How can I forget something so important? What are we doing here? We gotta go right away. Whoa there, Hero. Not so fast. You still got some unfinished work to do. You're supposed to usher in all of our VIPs for the fundraiser tonight. That's a Jossum. I'm sorry, but with all due respect, the Tofu fundraiser can wait. Hmm. My feelings are hurt, Hero. You haven't forgot about our contract, have you? Well, I... Uh, forget about the contracts! Basil needs us. We have to go, Hero! Ah, ha, ha, ha. Don't listen to her, Hero. Why would you? You didn't even sign a contract with her. I don't listen to Arby because of a contract. Listen to her because she's my friend. Sorry, Mr. Jocelyn. My friends are more important than a measly piece of paper. Measly piece of paper? You disrespect me, boy. I take you in. A youngin' with no experience. I turn you into the ultimate employee. You'll be nothing if it wasn't for me. The punishment for breaking a contract is death. I'll teach you respect. You, uh, uh, uh. whatever, boys. Would you be so kind as to show these kids the way out? Okay, well, Amori, uh, swing on this nigga. Aubrey, swing on this nigga. Kill. Um, I think you should uh, megaphone. And a hero. I don't know. You swing on Jocelyn back there. I don't know what this does. Come on, catch up! I'm doing all the work! Oh, that's funny! Oh, so it just immediately... It just immediately makes them, um... So the new the new follow-up attack just immediately makes them both enraged instead of just angry. Okay. Um... Omori, what do I want you to do? I don't even know what I want you to do. I guess I want you to mock... This bitch. Actually, I wonder can you mock that bitch back there? Aubrey, headbutt this bitch. Kill, flex. Hero, um, let's attack that bitch. Okay, it didn't do nothing, okay. His attack failed, though. Damn, damn. Dink, bitch. Dead ass bitch. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, this bitch called another nigga. Damn. 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 Okay, uh. Alright, I know what I'm gonna do. Mock that bitch again. Aubrey. You. Counter. Kill. You. Um, run and gun. 
This is gonna be overkill. I think I'm just having, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have you flex again, cause running gun is kind of overkill, but whatever. I wonder can I hit him with that though? Probably not. And hero, cook Aubrey up some good. But maybe I should fast food Omori. The only reason I was thinking about cooking because most likely the counter is gonna draw the attack to Aubrey, so I'm gonna I'm gonna risk it. Yeah, it didn't do shit. All right. Oh my gosh. Damn. There you go. Dink. All right. Okay. I knew that was gonna happen. So, um, Amori, mock that bitch back there. Fuck him. Aubrey, counter again. Kill. Flex. Hero. Cook for Aubrey again. Yeah, because most likely Amori isn't going to get hit right here. Oh my god. Can I break the phone? There you go. Maybe I have to aim at the phone or something. Amori, I think you can heal yourself because your health is dangerously low. Aubrey. You can't hit that. So what do I do to that bitch back there? Just keep killing these fucking sh uh, crocodiles? Well, just counter again. Kill. Um. Running gun, I guess. And then hero. Just. Cook Aubrey something up again. Oh my gosh, bro. Well. If this don't get him, I don't I don't know what to do no more. I was about to say. I want these kids gone, you understand? <laughs> the gator guy who runs them out gets free pizza. On me! What do you mean we're running low on hitchman? It's impossible! You let yourselves be foiled by a bunch of children? What did I even hire you for? Fuck that bitch. 4,000 XP, 6,000 clams, I'm rich. You found contract. Amori, go to level 24. Kale, go to level 24. I'm rich. Defeat Mr. Jawson. That's enough. Stand down, men. We're getting nowhere like this. Hmm. I gotta admit, you kids are pretty strong. But that doesn't matter now. Hero isn't the only ultimate employee in my workforce. I have... But one other. Who, barely? You can come in now, Pluto. Uh! Pluto, you work for this bitch. Sell out. Pluto, it's me, Kel! Don't you recognize us? We're your friends! Sorry, Kel. This is nothing personal. It's just business. What is that, a Jabberwocky laugh? Okay. Let's see how you do against the strength of a former planet. Pluto, show these kids your true power. Right away, sir. Um, sorry, everyone. This is the end of the road for you. Uh. All right. What is this magnificent twerk? What is he doing? Uh.
Uh, what is even happening right now? What am I looking at? Behold, this is my final form. Can you feel the heat? All right, well, you know what? <laughs> All right, bro. Um, I don't even know what I'm gonna have Aubrey do. This is fucking dumb. I think I'm gonna have her attack. That bitch talking about expanded. That's kind of funny. Kel is gonna flex. And Hero will smile. There you go. Right, okay, it immediately makes him enraged instead of just angry, okay. Hero speed fell, he takes 81 damage. Impressive progress, young Kale. Your flex has improved greatly. Alright, well... You know what to do, Amori. Stab that bitch. Aubrey, headbutt that bitch. Um, Kale, run and gun that bitch. And Hero, you can... I don't really know. Cause I don't have anybody countering right now, so I guess you could just cook yourself a meal. I don't really have you count. I don't have anyone countering right now, so all right. Think they intimidated you? Intimidated who? All right, whatever, bro. Well. I'm gonna have Aubrey headbutt again. I'm not gonna spam uh, counter and she's doing that much damage. Yeah, headbutt again. Kill, flex, hero. Cook something for Arby just in case Pluto get dangerous. Yep, 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 yep. Dink! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, 126? And it, it lowers his speed, so his damage is about to go down. He don't even do that much damage no more. All right. um, Stab that bitch again. Aubrey, you can counter now. Actually. Okay. Amori, that, that stab isn't doing that much damage. I want you to heal, kill. Aubrey, you can counter. Kill. You can run and gun, even though it's probably not going to do that much damage. And Hero, heal Aubrey. You know the drill. Hey, I knew I'm not going to do that much damage. Ooh, what? Threw a moon at her. What? No, fuck. <laughs> okay, bro. Um. All right, stab that bitch again. Aubrey... You can counter again. Kill. Flex again. Hero. Cook. Hmm. Ah, I see. You have all gotten stronger, but so have I. What? <laughs> he expands even further? God! Dink. Ooh, one, two, four, Aubrey. <laughs> okay, um, what will more your friends do? The same shit we've been doing. Stab. Aubrey, you can headbutt him this time. I ain't tripping. Kill. Um, running gun. Hero. Cook for Aubrey just in case. I don't really give a fuck. Because she's not doing a counter, so it's not like it's going to target her. Dink. Dink. Oh, that want a lot of damage. I could just keep countering if that's the case. Damn. Uh, did she take damage? I don't even think she took damage. I think it was just a more. I can't tell. Uh, you know, stab. Aubrey. Counter. Kill. 
works, I guess. Hero, cook. <laughs> like, what am I fighting, Nappa? Why did you cook the? You cooked it before she did. Okay, because he didn't do anything. He just kind of. All right. Wait, what? What will Amori do? Attack? Sure. Aubrey. Counter. You got a counter. Kill. Uh, running gun. Hero. Hero, you you can attack. I don't really give a fuck. Okay. Whoa! 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 <laughs> Whoa! This nigga planetary? All right, bro. Um. All right, Amori. You just keep stabbing that bitch. Give a fuck if he planetary. And just because he want to play, I'm going to show his ass a real planetary devastation with that big-ass head Aubrey got. Kill. Um, you can just flex on that bitch since this is about to be his last moments al al alive. And Hero. Um, cook something for Kill so he can make sure that this is the last thing he sees. Death. Death. Dink. Death. Goodbye. Hmm. Well done, children. You've come a long way, but I am not finished yet. What? What? Six thousand XP, five hundred clams. I want to go to level twenty-five. Learn stare. I right, we're gonna level twenty-five. Learn smash. I mean mash. Hero, go to level twenty-three. All right. Rematch. <sighs> You've all really gotten stronger. <sighs> I'm so I'm proud of you, but even still, I have a job to do, and I plan on finishing it. Embrace yourselves, children. This is the definition of power. When I flex, I feel my best. All right, all right, break it up. Cool it, Pluto. I'm already losing one ultimate employee today. I don't want to lose two. But, sir, I can defeat them. Just give me a little more time. Don't sweat it, Pluto. I ain't risking any more assets today. Didn't you say you wanted to be free? You're a fucking sellout. Just get out of here. <laughs> okay, bro. I've been nothing but a pain in my ass anyway. Th thank you, sir. You won't regret this. Hmm. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> There's really nothing I can do to get you to stay, huh? It's a pity. You could have reached your true potential here. Mr. Jocelyn, before we go, I just want to say that even after kidnapping all of my friends and tricking us into signing an ambiguous contract, I sometimes still thought of you as a pretty decent guy. Hero, this might come as a surprise to you, but... I always thought of you as the son I never had. <laughs> I know you do great things out there. Now get fucking gone already. Did you see I'm busy? Thanks again, Mr. Johnson. All right. All right, everyone. Now that we're all together again, we can continue our search for Basil. It's been a long journey, but I just know that we'll find him. As long as we don't give up. You're right, hero. We're almost at the finish line. I can feel it. Wait for us, Basil. We'll find you in no time at all. Now that that dedication, that's the shit I like to see. What? Go get them, you crazy kids. All right. Give me the fuck out of here. All right, before I forget, I'm going to take this. This is Justin Gives. I gave you a VIP key card. Wow. There. Now the elevator should run faster. Just a warning, though. Sometimes it gets bumpy. Uh, let me heal first, and then I'm going to save. Actually, no. I'm going to get where I know I'm going to be able to walk out. 
Because I might load this game up and forget where the fuck I'm at. Um, concierge, I guess. Hi, I'm Mira. I'm new here. Okay. Them replacements come fast, don't it? You give your life to these corporations, they just toss your shit. They don't give a damn about you. They don't give a damn about you. Woohoo! The gang is back. High five, everyone. So, does anyone remember how we ended up here? You know, I had the strangest dream. There we were. All of us falling down an endless black hole. The next thing I know, I'm signing my life away through a fucking contract. You know what they say? Sure is strange where life takes you. So, what are we doing again? We were looking for Basil or something, right? Yeah, that's right, Kill. Looking for Basil. Hmm. You think Basil could be anywhere in the last resort? No way, Basil wouldn't be caught dead here. He seems like the type of person who would enjoy things like this. I don't know, does he? Why don't we just go around and ask anyone if they've seen him? Good thinking, Kill. No, I guess we're pretty far away from home. I don't think anyone here would know what he looks like. Oh, I have an idea. Why don't we just draw a picture of him? And people will be able to recognize him from the drawing. You two are full of good ideas today. That sounds like a plan. Cool, I'll start. Uh, what is that? It's nothing like Basil. Basil's hair is more like this. Uh. Hmm. No, wait. That doesn't look right either. Hey, what are you doing to my masterpiece? And when did Basil have such a big nose? Alright, let's see how we're doing. Uh, yeesh. Is that really what Basil looks like? Ugh. I can't look. He'll put the bad drawing in your pocket. Okay, bro. <sighs> well, that didn't go so well. Oh, you down, Aubrey. We can just look for Basil ourselves. Yeah, it'll be okay. There's plenty of places we haven't looked yet. Hmm. Why don't we start searching around the deep well? We can get there pretty easily by taxi. There's always one in the uh, front of the last resort. Okay, can I see what that image looked like? Oh, God. <laughs> it's not even that bad. It's just funny. Okay. Let's see what this bitch selling. Pool noodle? It may look unassuming, but it has the... Uh, basically, if you five five thousand players. Uh, I, I don't know. Sure, let's see. You got a pool noodle. Well, I wonder whose attack that is. Let me see. Yeah, probably not yours. Worn and harder to use. You can no longer see your reflection. Wow. That's different. Pool noodle. It is completely useless. Who invented this anyway? I would figure that it was. I just wanted to see. That's exactly why I'm bad shit from that bitch no way. But I'm rich, so I don't give a damn. When you're rich, you can afford to make mistakes. <laughs> Fucked up how that shit go, but it's true. But that's why everybody want to be rich. Because we want to be able to make a mistake and not fucking die. Don't, you know what I'm saying? Like, quit playing with me. Reduces all of a fold's stats. Damn. <laughs> um. Should I add that one, y'all? I don't know. I might add that one on some funny shit. Stare. Give me that. Oh, bro, now, Arbor, you got something called Mash. What is that? If this skill defeats a foe, recover 100% of juice. That's probably only for you, though. Well, I'm never buying anything from that man again. Okay. Well, lies at the bottom of the ocean and twitches. A nervous wreck. Okay, bro. I'm gonna fucking... Hold on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna save. And then I'm gonna do this little picnic and see what niggas talking about. And then I'm gonna get up out of here. So, Miramar. What are you doing? You're waiting for us. Oh. Nothing out of the ordinary. I say hello and try to make small talk with the folks who pass by. Yeah, that sounds exhausting. I can't small talk at all. Miramari, tell us. Who's the most interesting person you've come across? Well, let's see. Around this area, I typically see cranky tourists and gator guys. 
The gator guys are a little rough around the edges. But once they open up, they'll share just about everything with you. They're even nicer than most of the tourists. Yeah, I agree. All the gator guys I've met have been really nice to me. They are. They're always treating me like I'm in trouble or something. Let's see, what else? Ah, come to think of it, I do remember a chronically unlucky fellow named Snaily. I used to see him wandering around a lot. But the one time he tried to walk up to greet me, he suddenly fell into a hole. Never saw him again after that. Uh, boring. Next. That's probably really important, isn't it? All right. That was Omori episode something. I don't, I don't fucking know. Um, like if you fuck with it, man. Like if you fuck with it. Comment if you got any of the games you want me to play. Subscribe for more content like this. I will catch y'all niggas in the next one. Peace. I bit the shit out my lip, though.